Hello, and welcome to Open Hotels demonstration of our property management system. In this video, we're going to take an overview and just look around so you can see the functionality and uh, the depth of the abilities of the Open Hotel property management system. You'll also find other videos that cover other aspects of our software, but let's dive right in and do an overview of the property management system. This is the dashboard that your front desk and other reservation agents uh, or your revenue managers may use. It gives you a quick overview in this flash report of exactly what's going on on your property management system at any second. You'll also see pending arrivals and pending departures. On the arrivals, you'll also notice that any repeat guests are annotated. You can also click in there and see how many times that they have stayed with you. As we scroll down, you'll see the tape chart. Tape chart shows who's in each room. It also displays if there's any notes that are shown on that reservation or if there's money due on that reservation. On the rooms, you'll see each room can have an annotation. This will help your reservation staff select rooms that are specific to room to guest requests, such as, I would like to be close to the elevator, or please put me close to the volleyball court. You'll also see a tab that says Rates and Availability Overview. This gives you a quick look at exactly what's going on on any day. You can view this weekly, bi-weekly, monthly, or daily. You can check your availability on your different OTAs. And you can also see Right. So if someone calls and says you have availability for next Saturday, you can quickly see if you do or not. If it is green, that means there's availability. If it's yellow, that means that some rooms have been sold. If it's red, it means you're sold out. You can scroll or you can select a date from here. Now that you know your way around a little bit, let's go ahead and make a reservation. There's three different areas that you can access to make a reservation. You can come up to the menu bar and hit New Reservation. You can click in the top of your dashboard and hit New Booking. Or you can book directly by clicking on a specific room date and book directly from there. We're going to do it from the menu bar so I can show you the different options. So if a guest calls in and says they're going to stay for a couple of days, you can select either from the drop down or from the calendar. You want to select the number of adults. You can do a standard booking or a group booking. Your groups are shown along with the dates. We're just going to do a plain Jane one and do a standard booking. And you're going to click check availability. After hitting check availability, it's going to show you anything that's available based on the criteria that you set up. It will show you any of your standard discounts like AAA, AARP, it will also show you any packages that are available. It will also state if there's a package available, but you may not have met the criteria. If you want to see more information about this package, you simply click on the question mark and it will show you exactly what's involved. So you're completely knowledgeable when you're on the phone or if you have a guest at the front desk. But again, we're going to do plain vanilla. I'm going to click book. This is where you put in the information for your guest. As you start typing, 
it will go ahead and look for past guests that have stayed with you and you can select them you'll also notice that if there's any notes that are involved with this guest you'll notice here that I have stayed twice I'm a VIP guest one time and then I also made a mess this will also be reflected when I click on the guest you'll notice that there's an important note that's been tied to this guest forever if I have a credit card that I've used in the past the last four digits will show or I can do add a new card I'm going to default it to none but you can also take cash check direct bill so you can bill directly to the company if you want to adjust the rates it's here this option is able to be turned off at the department level so if you have front desk people that you do not want to have them change the rates you can turn that off obviously we support nonprofit organizations so you can omit all taxes we also have a very uh, full featured surcharge application that you can go ahead and opt out of those if you're not going to charge the person any uh, surcharge it may be reflective you'll also see that you can book options right here such as pet fees rollaways crib and extras we have a full a la carte functionality where you can add as many extras into a reservation as they wish so they can build their own package these extras also reflect on the uh, IBE your internet booking engine so the guests can select their own go ahead and add two of these and you'll see if one is not available for one for whatever reason that it will reflect here you can assign the room here we're not going to do this right now because I want to show this to you on the next screen your policy is reflected this policy is specific to what you've chosen on this reservation not only does it include your hotel policies but it includes any specific room that may policy that may be specific to this room such as a pet policy for a specific room type or any special policies for this date such as if there's a special event you may have separate policies such as parking or no trailer parking uh, this type of thing notes and messages these are the notes that have been left before you can add additional notes right here with a lot of different options pretty simple straightforward but full featured we're going to go ahead and hit submit it's going to take us to our confirmation page this is the confirmation number right here if the guest is a walk-in you would simply check them in if it's on the phone you go over the reservation with them you'll also see there's additional tabs now you can change this reservation the payment has notification that it has not been paid you can assign it to a room parking lot notes if you keep track of light license plates confirmations you can also resend those here's the activity log on this specific reservation it shows everything that has happened and it will continue through the life of this reservation and guest history me staying here all right but we're going to bop back over to the main dashboard and you'll see that here i am again and i'm unassigned your unassigned rooms show up here and even though they're unassigned obviously they've already been taken out of inventory so you don't have to worry about that now i could drag and drop into any of the rooms simply drag and drop but I'm not going to do that yet I'm going to show you a check-in and I'll do it at that time I'm going to check myself in 
You'll see here all the rooms that are available show up. If they were dirty, they would be in red, but we have nothing but clean rooms right now. So these are the available rooms. You'll also see then I can set the room to do not move. And I'm going to check myself in. So check in is very easy. You can also print two different types of folios with a lot of different options. Languages. You can hide the details. You can hide all totals. You can hide the room totals. So you could show incidentals. Just for grins, we'll come back here and we'll put this in Danish. And you'll see that everything is in the other language. Now let's take a quick tour of some of the other functionalities and features that are available. We're going to start over here under Utilities. And you'll see a number of different things. We have a built-in phone directory. You can get rid of all of the sticky notes all over your front desk and have a centralized place where everything is listed. We also have multi-departments. It starts with a standard four departments, but you can add as many as you wish. And under each department, your staff can be customized for what they can do at any level. You'll also see what users are under this department. We also have responses. Responses are, are a phenomenal feature. You can custom make email templates that can either go out manually or they can go out automated to your guests either before check-in or at check-out. So for example, you could have a response set up after check-out that says, thank you for staying with us. Please review us on TripAdvisor. Here's the link. If you didn't have a good time, please call me first. You could also do a response that comes out before they arrive. We're looking forward to seeing you in a few days. Don't forget our front desk closes at 8 p.m. It's also a great way to have pre-made templates that go out manually only for things such as, we found a iPhone charger in your room. Okay, please contact us. That way you don't have to have your front desk writing an email, it's directly in the system. We also have a mini POS. You can set up your products and right here, you can sell your products. You can do it either with or without a guest name. You can do it by category. You can even have unlisted products. You can add yourself on the fly. This is also a great way to use things such as room damage because it's all built in. On your rooms, you have room options such as uh, roll away in cribs. They're specific to each room type. We have amazing group functionality with every type of option and inventory that I think that you could ever need. We have two types of packages. We have the standard package, which is day three, get horseback riding and flowers in your room, or we have what we call extras. Extras is our a la carte packaging. You can make this available to the public, or you can have it available just if they call in. It's extremely full featured, right down to the point that it will also send an email to the provider. So if you have a florist that you're working with, then you can easily send them an email when the flowers are booked so you don't have to worry about fulfillment. It also supports booking not on same day or too close to the date. 
So if you want to send the, tell the florist that it needs a three-day time frame, then you can set it up that way so somebody's not booking in your parking lot and showing up at the front desk and expect you to have roses. Lots of reports. We'll go over the reports in just a second. Lots of different uh, rate planned availability. We're going to go over this in another separate video. So this is a quick overview of the Open Hotel Property Management System. I hope you have enjoyed it. We would love to talk to you and see if this is what exactly what you're looking for. Make sure we're a good match. If you have any specific questions, you can reach us at openhotel.com. We have chat available. We can show you things right there. Or if you'd like to schedule a personalized demo, we'd love to talk to you.